like the weather has cleared up somewhat. Let's start moving. Yay! That was faster than I thought! Blanc, Noir, can I leave you in charge? Of course. We'll hold down the fort. You go ahead. Yeah, what she said. Okay, I'll be back. Yippee! Thank you, everyone! You all can look forward to the best fireworks display you've ever seen! Da-da-da! Let's set off fireworks wherever it is we'll go! Not long until we reach the top! I can already tell the fireworks are going to be spectacular! You bet! Hmm. I'm glad that I tagged along. Hmm? Are you crying? You always find a way to surprise me. I thought the weather had cleared up, but apparently I was mistaken. The wind is too strong. Are you okay, servant? Even I feel a bit cold. I've never seen weather this bad here. <sighs> we can't stay out here, or else we'll be in real danger. Balorta. Mika. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid we'll have to head back down. The storm is really picking up. Huh? If we continue to press on, there's no telling what might happen. We need to head back and try again when the weather calms down a bit. She's right, Blorta. Even if we did make it to the top, the fireworks wouldn't look nearly as nice in these conditions. Ah, uh, that is true. Uh, fine, let's go down. I can't be selfish and put everyone in jeopardy. This is not good. Servant, grab my hand. One false move, and you might get swept away. Belorta and Mika, follow me. You hear that, Belorta? Stay close. No fooling around. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. If we head down just a little more. Hmm. right for us get to the side oh my god oh my god pull yourself together mika move it uh, yes yes i didn't realize it would get so bad so quickly we need to hurry is everyone okay
<gasps> she was right beside me, I'm sure of it. But the snow engulfed us. No, it, even when it covered us. Wait, that's it. She could be buried under all this snow. Come on, Valorta. Stop playing around. You know I don't like these practical jokes of yours. Valorta? Valorta? No. This can't be happening! N no No, 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 no! Valorta! Where are you? Valorta? Valorta! Uh, uh, uh. I knew it! We should have never come here! I should have known better! Christmas can only be a day of tragedy for me! Today sure isn't your lucky day! These children's lives are just as important as my own. Until every last child at Angel Orphanage grows up and can take care of themselves, they are my responsibility, and I will never shirk my responsibilities. The Sovereigns will do all we can to... assist you in accomplishing that. <laughs> Thank you. By the way, I've brought some Christmas presents for the children. May I show them? Yes, of course. How did you get that injury to your shoulder? Oh, this? I... It's nothing. The director hit her. <sighs> I, uh, I didn't mean to hit her, of course. It's, it's just that she's so incorrigible sometimes and... Just a moment. Mm, we can end the photo shoot here. Let's go get something to eat. I've brought in some of the finest chefs available. I'm terribly sorry about this. See to it that the children are taken care of. We do not want the Sovereign's reputation to suffer as a result of any mistreatment. <laughs> I'm warning you. Should one word of this get out, there will be no more financial aid from our end. Mm. I understand. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. <sighs> I knew this would happen. <sighs> Blorta, are you okay? You're drenched in sweat. I think I've got an upset stomach. Until earlier today, we hadn't eaten in so long. So I think that's what did it. We need to get you to a hospital. Should I call the director? No, 
I'll be better once I lie down for a bit. What are you doing? I've read somewhere that massaging your hands helps with a stomach ache. Really? Actually, I do think I feel a little bit... Uh... Belorta! There you are. Today is all your fault, you little... What's going on? What's wrong with her? M mister Belorta says her stomach really hurts. I think she should go to the hospital. What, so you two can go blabbing to the doctors about how you got hit? I don't think so. She'll just have to put up with it. the doctor that she got hurt while playing or, or could you at least get her some medicine please I'm begging you how many times am I going to have to tell you you're not going to the hospital period so give it up please mister is in a lot of pain. You've already pissed me off enough with that little stump with the Sovereign. If you had half a brain and had covered up your injury... But, Belorta, what are you doing? Okay. I just need to endure it a little longer. It'll pass. No, you can't do this! Belorta? <laughs> Belorta! 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 And again, I wasn't able to protect you. Not again. Don't die on me again. I'm so sorry, Belorta. You must be so cold. It was cold that day, too. Mika, get a hold of yourself. Mika. I understand how hopeless you must be feeling right now. But it's more important than ever in times like this that you remain calm. So why don't you sit here and rest until you've pulled yourself together? Servant and I will search the area. to me. Trust me. Found anything? It's no use. The weather isn't cooperating. We're not getting any signal either. 
Things are going from bad to worse. I propose that we head back and gather our... The wind is picking up. Another avalanche might be imminent. We need to head back to Snowfield. We can win! Something happen? Where's Belorta? She got swept away by the avalanche. <gasps> what? What can we do? The avalanche came out of nowhere. Did you see where she got carried away? No. Like I said, it was all so sudden. We didn't even have time to get out of the way. Because of that, our potential search area is substantial. Since the other members of Unlimited aren't here at the moment, you guys will need to be my support. We're at your disposal. Thank you. The map gives a good overview of the area around the northern base. This is our current location. Alorta went missing at the rear of the mountain behind Snowfield Hot Spring, about 0.6 miles away from here. Absolute and Delta will proceed northwest. Roger. Okay. Got it. Understood. Signal, you stay here and handle any and all communications. Visibility out there is poor, so we'll need someone to be our eyes and ears. Can do. In lieu of Alice, Neve, and Tove, I'll have Blanc and Noir accompany me. You can count on us. Understood. Actually, Servant, I thought it might be better for you to stay here with Signal. This snowstorm is the worst I've ever seen. If you were to come with us, you'd only be putting yourself in danger. Well, if you insist, we'll head out together. Also, one more thing. 
Before the avalanche, we felt a great vibration coming from underneath us. So what you're saying is... It could happen again. If you feel a tremor while we're out there, don't move from your position. We can use this to cinch ourselves together. After we've done that, the hook can be anchored to the ground. Got it. I presume we'll be going up against raptures as well? What do you think, genius? Is this your first time up on the surface or something? I'm just worried about them coming across Balorta. Good point. If she's not injured, she should be fine. But if she is... Do you think she could fend them off on her own? All we can do is hope that Belorta was able to find a safe place to hide. In the meantime, we need to hurry up. Okay, what's the next step? What we'll do is... Just calm down and give it another shot. Delta, can you hear me? Reading you loud and clear. If communications get cut off, all you need to do is press the reset button once. Got it. Commander, don't you think it would have been better to dress in thicker clothing? This should do the trick. Unwa. Any chance you could take a gander at my firearm while you're at it? Noir, do you think we should bring the gloves and straps that we use for our performances? They might come in handy. Yeah, let's do that. Right. Until then, you just have to take it easy. You've got me worried. You look as pale as a sheet. Relax. We'll find her no matter what it takes. That's right. It'd be a real blow to Unwa's pride if we didn't find anything. That's enough from you. <sighs> hey. Are you planning on sitting here staring into space all day? <sighs> Are you really going to sit back and do nothing? <sighs> Belorta would be devastated if she saw you like this. Resigned to the fact that she's already dead. Look at you, unable to even lift a finger to help. Mika. Well? Are you going to sit here with that ridiculous look on your face and let your friends slip away? <laughs> You're really just going to leave her to die like this? What did you say? Belorta told me everything. What happened that Christmas back at the orphanage? <gasps> so, I'll ask again. Are you going to let yourself sink into despair? Let it render you powerless and lose your friend again? Are you going to abandon your friend to die a cold, lonely death out there in the snow? No! I... I'm going to find her! 
can look alive. Don't give up. Erase the very idea of death from your mind. You must believe that she is alive. Because she is. The Lorta isn't dead yet. She's waiting for you to come find her. She knows that you're out there searching for her. That you're willing to scour every inch of this mountain in order to find her. I'll be there guiding you the entire way. If you can't trust yourself, then trust me. I will do whatever it takes to find Belorta for you. Now let's go and find our friend. Together. Okay. I'll go with you. I believe it. Belorta is alive. She must be. And we're going to find her. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being so weak. I was scared that history was repeating itself. <laughs> it's perfectly normal to cry when you're scared. Let it all out. When you're done, we'll go find Belorta. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much for doing this. Everyone. I'll do whatever I can to help. These are signal flares. If we set these off, it might make the search easier for us. As they'll help light the way. However, they'll almost certainly draw raptures to our location. So we should be prepared. But don't worry about that. Yeah, we can kick Rapture butt no problem. Well said. Raptures aren't a problem for us. Is everyone ready? Ready. Comms are all looking normal. All good on Absolute's end. Noir and I are good to go as well. <laughs> ready when you are. Let's move. Coming, Belorta. Just hold on. Initiating engagement sequence. Visibility is severely compromised. Is this where the avalanche happened? Yes. Judging from the direction the snow is headed, I think we should head to the right. Wait a moment! This is... This is the signal flare that Belorta had! <gasps> if that's true, then that confirms we're heading in the right direction. She might be closer than we thought. We should keep our eyes peeled for any other clues that could help lead us to Belorta. Visibility is starting to improve somewhat, at least to the point where we can see objects in the snow. Noted. I'll take the lead. Hey, Mika. Why don't you hold our hands while you walk? We're the lucky bunnies, after all. We can share some of our luck with you. Maybe we'll be able to help you find Belorta more easily. Go ahead and hold on to her hand, Noir. Here, Mika. Take my hand. <sighs> Thank you, both of you. Mm. 
Mika is stronger than we initially gave her credit for. I think she's finally realized that inaction only gives birth to suspicion and fear. By taking action like we're doing now, you can take those negative emotions and turn them into courage and confidence. What we can do is help encourage her, so that she stays strong and doesn't give up. Good. Let's keep moving. Huh. Everyone, look! It's Belorta's socks! Seems like we're getting closer. Excellent! Looks like your luck is starting to rub off on me. I think Belorta may be somewhere close by. I'm going to set off a signal flare. Lorta, if you see this, please respond. Please! It's really quiet. <sighs> hmm. Is this the end of this path? The only thing up ahead is a cliff face. But all the clues have led us to this point. She has to be here somewhere. Just in case, Noir and I will go check out the cliff. There might be a way for us to get around it. I'll stretch my body out like this, see? Noir and I are both very flexible. Yeah, that'll be easy for us to do. Impressive. I'll leave that to you, then. You brought your gloves, right? Put those on and make sure you're holding my hand tight. Otherwise, I might fall. You got it. I think I see something. Just a little bit more. that you were so worried about me. Anywho, I just had a look-see and there's definitely a side path just below the cliff. It'll be a tight squeeze, but I think we'll be fine as long as we walk single file. Glad to hear that. But it won't be easy getting down there. We won't have to worry about that. I brought a rope ladder just in case. We typically use these during our acrobatic performances. So it's capable of holding both of us. You're quite well prepared. Thanks. You're so organized, Noir. Very nice. Well, should we head down? No, wait. I think another big gust is coming. Another avalanche might be just around the corner. Let's hide in that cave and make our move later. I hope nobody gets hurt! I can see this! Dust yourself off and give it another go!
This battle's finished. Moving on. Servant, do you remember the story Belorta told us about her past? Yes. <sighs> I didn't mention it at the time. But I have a connection to that place as well. A familial connection, to be precise. I knew that our family sponsored an orphanage. But I had no idea that such horrific things were happening behind closed doors. I should have paid more attention. I guess it doesn't make that much of a difference talking about it now. I just wanted them to know that I'm not like the adults they dealt with as a child. Even if I didn't personally carry out that abuse, I should do everything I can to prevent it from happening again. I never want Mika and Belorta to feel the pain of being separated ever again. So I have to find her. I know. We just have to stay strong. Where am I? Mika? Old timer? Ludmilla? I need to get in touch with them. Darn. My phone got smashed. I need to get up. What? What's wrong with my ankle? Uh, can I even move like this? That's no good. Mika was right. Christmas is a bad day for me. Getting swept away by an avalanche. Phone dead. Ankle injured. If I had known this was gonna happen, I would have listened to Mika. I really thought today would be the best Christmas ever. This is the first time I've ever celebrated Christmas with so many people. And the first time I've made a cake? I was so happy. Uh. Uh. Am I going to die? <laughs> Dying on Christmas Day. Again. <laughs> oh no, what about Mika? Knowing her, that fool will end up getting herself killed trying to find me. If she ends up dying because I'm not here... Uh... No, I can't let that happen. It won't happen. I won't let Mika die. <sighs> I'll leave this place alive. And when I do, I'll wipe the tears off that crybaby's face. The thrill of battle is undeniable. The ladder is good to go. I'll go down first and make sure it's secure. 
Noir will follow me. And then hold the ladder steady for everyone. Got it. All right. Away I go. See you down there. Mika and Servant, you go next. I'll go last. Okay. We made it! The path here is wider than I thought. Still, be careful when you're coming down. At all. You're being very brave right now. <laughs> well, off I go. Oh boy, that was further down than I thought. My legs were shaking like leaves. I will go ahead and investigate the path with Blanc. Understood. Motion down there. Did something happen? N no! The ladder is pretty slippery, so be careful. Alright, I'm coming down now. I wasn't so hard. Much sturdier than I thought it'd be. Let's hurry. What'd you find? This! Do you remember this, old timer? It's the snowball! Valorta was playing with at Snowfield Hot Spring. Blanc and I found this beside one of these trees. That means Belorta might be close by. Precisely! She might even have left these to let us know she was here. Things are looking up. Let's keep heading in this direction. Just calm down and give it another shot. Wonderful Danny Wong. 